Welcome viewers, welcome to my channel Genome Voice Study. If you are new on my channel, please subscribe and press the bell icon. So you will get the notification of all the new videos. I have received many emails, comments and texts on WhatsApp that Plan Genome Database website for calculating the KAKS values is not working. Although I have also mentioned the another method of KAKS calculation through TB tools, but maybe viewers did not understand it properly. So I thought that why not make video on another method of calculating the KAKS value. How to do? Let's start. It is a online method, so first you need to go or open the Google browser and Google then write K A K S calculation tool then this one services that cbu dot uib dot no tool k a k s calculation open it you need to open this uh, website the link of this website is also given in the video description you can also take that link simply copy and paste it and then open it you can find it this link in the video description now you need the data or your sequence dna sequence that cds sequences in faster format and the minimum sequences are three maximum and any that you have you can simply copy paste or choose the file so here i have the sequences of my genes in a cds form so i control all copy and then i paste it in that box and then simply go down and here click on submit so here it said that when the result is ready it will be presented here if you experience any problem so it is instruction that your working is going on so you can wait a minute or two after that your result will be shown here So here are your Ka value and Ks value. This is a branch one. This is branch one. A Ks of branch one and this is a Ks Ka of branch one. And this is a, a Ka of branch two and Ks of branch two. These are the ratio Ka Ks ratio. So simply you can copy that all table copy this all table and then paste it into your excel sheet so here are the nodes that this is a node 1 result node 2 and node 3 but we didn't know that which our genes are located on this node or this node so we can find it from here this one annotated phylogenetic tree in pdf form so you can view it click on view so this is your 
phylogenetic tree with nodes so you can also save it by clicking on this arrow and download it and save it into your destination folder so we only take these nodes that like these, these two genes have here we skip that one that single that line or branch and also take this one this one this one so we check that which node it is so we can zoom it so here is the node number is written in green so this is the second node and this one is the first node so and this one is the second node so we delete the second node from here because we didn't need this branch gene we only need these genes so we delete the node 2 from here and another one is this one is uh, node 3 and this one is node 4 this is 5 so we didn't need 5 so delete the 5 and here is the node 8 but where is uh, 6 and 7 I think uh, yeah this one is 6 and this one is 7 so we also didn't need these 6 and 7 so I also delete that one This, this green one is written the node number so you can note that one this is this is 14 16 20 or if you want to see it clearly so you can also this uh, 11 and uh, here is 18 15 14 16 20 21 so 14 16 20 21 and uh, this is 23 23 20 23, 25, 28, 28, and then 
29 and this is 29 31 32 29 and uh, this is uh, 31 and 32 then 32 and, uh, and so we need only these nodes so you can delete other one I have highlighted them to make me easy so you can delete the other of So after getting the required nodes, so we need to calculate or make the KAKS values because here we have the KA of two branches that KA of branch one and KA of branch two. Here is the KAS of branch one and KS of branch two. So we need to make them together or align them together. Here you need to insert one column and here is also or because we need the average of these two values so this is a ka of branch one so we can also copy that ka of branch to our cut it and paste it here this is a ks of branch one here you can cut and paste ks of branch two so here you can take the ka and here is the ks average so is equal to average of these two means ka branch one ka branch two and then drag down so also apply this formula on that column our k a and k r value um, to remove the formula copy and then a yeah, special values so here the formula is deleted from here copy paste yeah, special values and then you need to delete that uh, that columns then here you can also calculate the KAKS value or ratio sorry so is equal to KA divided by ks so here you can drag it and here you can see that here we have the zero so you can also delete that one we didn't need that so now you can also delete that uh, column uh, you have got that ka ks values and their ratio but 
now the question arises that this ka and ks value of which gene parallels so here you can insert another column and write gene parallel pairs yeah gene pairs gene pairs then go to the phylogenetic tree and see here that in node 1 which gene it is this is gene 27 and gene 22 you add node 1 so here you can see and write gene 22 gene 27 then node 3 check that in node 3 gene 36 and gene 17 gene 17 gene 36 then node 4 node 4 is 21 33 this one is node 4 this is gene 21 and gene 33 you can write gene 21 gene 33 now go to the node 10 this is 10 35 gene 3 after finding the name of all the genes gene pair so gene pair here you can also calculate the billion years ago that how long they were evaluated by applying the formula as i have told in the uh, previous video of kaks calculation the link of that uh, video is also present here you can see the link of that video so and also you can ch uh, check that they are the segmental duplication or tandem duplication so you can use these in your uh, manuscript or your dissertation or where you need to want to apply it so this is another method of calculating the kaks value hopefully this will help you and solve your problem if you have any theory then you can also text me or comment please like share and comment the video thank you